Hey, hello, how's it going? Welcome to another 20 Minutes Till Dawn video. It's me, Cranberry. How's it going? Hopefully you're doing well. Um, we are going to be revisiting a build we did a little while ago, uh, the Luna Smite build. We're going to be doing the same thing, but when we last played it, we it was it was before the most recent uh, perk update. So, Soul Hearts didn't exist yet. Uh, there's a couple ways to play this, probably. Uh, the most obvious way is like the Diamond Smite build. Uh, pretty strong, makes sense with Diamond because she has the highest starting health. But I think with the new Spirit Heart mechanics, I think there's good potential for Luna's black hole pulling enemies in in the early and mid game being a pretty big benefit to this build uh, over Diamond. Uh, Shauna also a pretty decent option for this too, I think. Just you know the extra extra look at a perk uh, is pretty cool, like the ability to reroll, right? Pretty pretty strong ability in general. But we're gonna start with Luna. We're playing Shotgun. Quick, quick peek at the rune page. Nothing too crazy. We're going Power Barrage, Glass Cannon, and Cadence. Like, close combat is just so stinky that I think I even prefer Barrage still, but they're both, you know, whatever. What are you, you going to do? And Aftershock as well, pretty bad. Uh, and then the shield side, we got Courage, Momentum, Blessing, and Growth. Nothing too crazy. Let's uh, let's get in there. We're going to be playing on the Pumpkin Patch, and hopefully this... I, 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 have, I have a good feeling about this build. I don't think we're going to you know, break any new records here, but I think this will work. Is how I would describe it, I think. They gotta not make the black holes too far out of bounds, I'm realizing. If I can help it. Uh first first perk. I mean, hey, for the for the smite build, I guess arrow magic also kind of synergizes with this. We'll take we'll take it here. Not the worst perk in the world to see first, but I don't know. Not 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 the abysmally worst perk ever there to see. And then here, you love, we, 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 we don't need Kunoichi for this build, but we do want Assassin. I think we actually don't want Kunoichi, now that I think about it actually, yeah. That's not a perk we actually actively want to see here. Anyway, hopefully you're doing well, I'm having a pretty good day today. Nothing super crazy going on with me, but um... Oh man, power shot is really good, but give me the sniper here again. Assassin, first priority. Um, I will say it's not unexpected, but I released a video uh, for me it was yesterday. For you, it might be two days ago. I don't know, but I released a video doing like a, a little bit of like an analytical deep dive on the uh, data that the Dark and Darker Devs released. Oh my God, that's a really fast assassin, by the way. So I, I did a bit of like an analytical deep dive on that and uh, the video like analytically did pretty poorly but it also just like what's weird about it is that it also just didn't uh, like it didn't get many impressions like the actual like YouTube system itself kind of like just didn't recommend it very much to people. I don't know. A little unfortunate there but also dark and darker you know I, it makes sense that like maybe YouTube understands that um the game is like more active when the like as far as viewership is when the when the play tests are active themselves. So it makes sense to me that like it didn't do that well, but it's just you know, I didn't like do like oh I put a ton of work in this video. I literally just sat there for an hour and just talked about the data in the in the in the data dump from Iron Iron Mace. So you know what do you like? I'm not I'm not upset about the video not doing well. It's just like I wanted to talk to people about it. I thought the data was really interesting, and I was hoping people would like you know. Would see the video and be like, oh, I thought X, Y, and Z, yada, yada, right? I thought it could maybe be cool. But, uh, you know, whatever. What are you, what are you, what are you going to do, right? I would love to see... Uh, I mean, again, seeing Assassin as early as we did is very cool. I would love to see a double shot. Because we do need to get mini clip in this run eventually. Well, I was going to say Soul Reap 2. I think Soul Reap is kind of like a little bit more important here, actually. We need to get we need to get soul powered ASAP. It's really important, and we also need to get uh, the converter, so that way we can start getting our max pH our max HP higher for the uh, for the smite as well. Okay, well that was a pretty fast soul powered. Things are going pretty well for us. Extremely early uh, spirit heart, extreme or you know, not, extremely early uh, assassin, extremely early soul powered here. This is this is pretty good. 
Definitely a good start for us. Uh, and then here, oh man, Holy Arts is really good too. I, I'm taking Holy Arts, I think before, you know, Mini Clip, we want Mini Clip, but it's not like essential for us, I don't think. At least right now it's not, I don't know. Maybe maybe that's wrong of me. Maybe I should be prioritizing uh, Double Shot sooner, but I kind of like this. This seems good to me. Oh man, these are all amazing too. You can take Holy Might first. Let's get a damage bonus, bonus, a damage bonus on Smite immediately. That seems pretty strong. Okay, a Cosmic Burst doesn't really do anything for us, and is the reason why this build absolutely does not work with with grenade launchers. Thank you, Cosmic Burst. Uh, here. I'll just take Arrow Mastery, I think. Just a nice flat damage boost of the Whirlwind seems pretty good. And another Spirit Heart for Soul Powered is good. We do need the, uh, the Converter as soon as possible, too. Okay, the game is paying attention today. Appreciate it, game. Cool thing about this build is that we don't need uh, Kunoichi as a as a part of it, so we can just, uh, in theory, get uh, Soul Link, whatever the one is that deals damage when you take da when you lose a Spirit Heart. We could do that as well potentially to just you know wipe out. Uh, uh, entire ways of enemies. I don't think it's like the, the like unlike unlike the uh, the forest. This map, it's once you get like really like set up. Also, a fresh clip here is very good for mini clip. Once you get like set up, it is very hard to actually like take damage without also uh, losing DPS. Right on the on the forest, if you want to keep shooting enemies, but you also want to take a little bit of damage, you can just walk into a tree. On this map, it's not as easy. Um, so yeah. And then here, I mean... Bullet speed is nice for the, the increased distance the shot goes. Kill clip is, is no blow, and it's not a bad perk. I just, I just don't know how Kill Clip interacts with one-shot guns, because I feel like you shoot the gun and immediately start reloading, and you don't get the benefit of the of the reload reduction speed. But I don't know for a certain. I'm going to follow my gut here and assume that Kill Clip does nothing for us. I think penetration is like a slight benefit, so we'll take that. Just for the shot speed. Shouldn't I, shouldn't one of my spirit hearts converted into max HP by now? Maybe it already didn't, I wasn't paying attention, I don't know. Weird. Oh, well, there's another spirit heart. Did I not take the soul conversion? I must be losing my mind, I must have not taken it and I'm losing my mind. That must be that must be what's happening here. Um sure, why not? No, I took it. Oh, the the soul hearts so so these two soul hearts that I took were after I took the perk, I believe. So okay. They will just never become real hearts. That is interesting. Maybe I should let you hit me then so I can lose these hearts. I don't know, that's a weird one. Uh, these all stink. I will take uh, Tome of Elements because it, it is not a negative. I don't know. No, because if I take intentional damage, I lose the one heart that I have so far. I don't think it's worth it. I think we just, you know, just chill on them. Uh, and 
on here, you probably go power shot for the, the raw damage upgrade. Arm and ready is pretty good too. Or take mini clip eventually, so. I don't believe you want it. Love seeing mini clip at some point here. You know what we kind of need on this run too? Not like a definite, but we would not hate to see it. Would not hate to see uh, uh, recharge. I do also like to see double shot, I will say. Probably a little bit more important than recharge to get mini clip. Teensy bit more of a bigger deal. Okay. Hey, we're like 100% sure that soul charge does work, right? Like, I, I mean, I'm not paying attention to my damage before and after picking up spirit hearts. But, like, it definitely does. Like, you know, not that to be too skeptical, but after feed the beast, you know, but didn't do anything. I'm a little bit worried. Also, kill, kill, kill clip is again no blow adding here. But I wouldn't hate seeing death rounds on this run, so I don't hate taking, like, a rapid fire into, into light bullets, into siege, into stand your ground here. I think we go with that. All right, I stand near the edge, kill as many enemies off out of bounds as you can. Why is my max HP never increasing? I wonder what this bug is today. You know what? Hit me. Someone hit me. I'm going to get rid of all these spirit hearts and get new ones. And then it's definitely going to work this time. Hit me. Oh, shield's back. Okay. But th that was like... Oh, wait. I have five. I I'm dumb, actually. I have five max HP. Yeah, they have been converting. Okay. They just don't make a noise. Oops. <laughs> uh, At this point... At this point, I don't know. I don't think I want to add any summons yet, but if I did, I would probably put Dragon Egg in for, for Age Dragon. Uh, Dragon Bond bonus. I can just take Electro Mage. Yeah, I can just go Electro Mage. Doesn't help that much. Maybe with Energize, we get like a, an occasional extra shot every once in a while. Yeah, my max HP is 6 now. <laughs> okay, so you know what? That's my bad. I'm a, I'm a dumb. I am a dumb. Uh, I don't hate seeing Fuseli, but Splinter is also pretty good. We don't really have any on-hit effects yet, though. I think this is actually a, a Splinter moment. And this is a Splinter gaming moment for sure. Not really getting overwhelmed, but we are. There are a lot of enemies on screen here. Here I'll take I'll take Splinter, I suppose. Okay. And then here we'll take Energize because the rest of the items there are just absolutely uh, garbage. Terrible stuff. Uh, I'm getting a phone call. Oh, I am. Hold on a second. One moment, please. Oh, okay. Hello. Hi, I'm back. Sorry about that. Uh, the phone call wasn't a half hour long, but I had to do other things as a result of the phone call. So now it's been about a half hour since, uh, I paused the recording. I mean, we're not, I know we're playing 20 minutes till dawn. I understand the general gist of what's going on here. Let me just re refresh myself. So we're Luna, Shotgun, we've got the Soul Powered stuff set up, we have the Soul Conversion, okay, uh, we're still trying to get Mini Clip, that's the big thing, Mini Clip, maybe, maybe a recharge in here too or something, okay, good, 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 let's, uh, let's get back in there, right back into it, uh, I guess I'll take Electro Mastery, I mean, like, Overload's not the worst thing in the world for this this video, but, like, you know, for this run here, but it, it's kind of, it's kind of meh. I don't know. Well, I mean, 
We're going on overload. I guess so. We have elemental barrage going. It is gonna, you know, pop out a lot of shots real quick. So that's nice too. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Fire starter is fine. Again, if we want overload, it's an option, right? But I think I just prefer Reaper rounds here. I think Reaper rounds is just better. Increase in damage. Uh, potential for uh, what's it called? The name I forget. You know, the thing. Um, I don't know. Uh, I guess. I mean, I know we're not going for Kunoichi on this one, but like, you know, haste and then like in the wind are not bad either. They don't hurt us. This seems fine. And here I think we take big shot. Big Shot's a pretty easy one for me, I think, here. Let's see. Man, I, I still just don't know if Soul Powered is actually helping or not. It, like, probably is, but, like, who knows. Electro Bug to not add any, any, uh any uh bloat there is probably the way to go bug itself not very useful but who knows okay witches are here got this little bit of xp okay light bullets that's death rounds now as an option for us I just can't, I can't see the numbers. I can't tell. I can't tell if our shots are doing more or less damage after picking up that soul heart. I don't know. You know, I think nobody knows. That's my theory. A game theory. Thanks for watching. At this point, all I really need is fan fire, so we can get, uh, well, fuse. I mean, we, I mean, we want fuse light too, I guess. We already have split shot, so we're just waiting for it to show up. Uh, we need fuse slave for mini clip. Add these, I guess I take soul link here. Um. There goes my shield. There's a little field wipe there from the uh, soul link. Coughing is here now too. Let's try to keep him out of bounds if we can. And then I guess, I guess we take fire starter here. I don't know. Oh, uh, sure. Why not? Oh, you know what? Move speed upgrades are not bad in general because we do have the tornadoes from Arrow Magic. Something to consider. It's not, it's not uh, irrelevant. Okay, what do you got for me? Implosion, sure. Seems fine. At this point, I think you take Kill Clip. Seems, seems okay. Oop, there we go. We lose that immediately. I don't know. Now we're just taking actual HP damage, which is not a good thing. <laughs> once we get, once we get a little bit further into this, it actually becomes easier. Once this rat bastard game eventually gives us, uh, oh, these all suck, man. 
Give me intense burn. At this point, it actually wouldn't be terrible to get a uh, soothing warmth either. Take that. People don't mind. Okay, we're getting a little little crowded here, but once there's no projectile enemies and no ghosts, once there's only these witches here, I think we're actually in a pretty good spot. I did say we wanted Soothing Warmth, but here I think you gotta take Overload. But actually, maybe that's not even good either. I don't know. We're not actually making that much lightning. Yeah, this is actually pretty bad, I think. Yeah, Soothing Warmth is actually almost certainly better. Hey, Soothing Warmth. Cool, thank you. Where's Mini Clip? Oh, we, need, we still need Fanfire for Mini Clip, huh? Oh, there's a little bit of damage. Uh, I'll take Magnetism here because I think Recharge is actually really good for us once we get Mini Clip. Okay, fan fire. There we go. Thank you. Thank you. So, waiting for death rounds, too, which I think we have the pieces of as well. It was taking that one so long to show up, huh? here actual just garbage i guess hey divine wrath could reload our gun a little bit for us that seems fine okay this doesn't do anything for us because our hp is already maxed out but i'll take that here thank you very much hey recharge is a good thing Let us shoot a lot more bullets, which is good. I wouldn't say desperately, but we do very we do very much still need mini clip to show up. And even even though I think I said it was a very high priority, I did end up taking it at a pretty high rate. Like anytime we saw like a mini clip perk we needed, I think we did almost always take it so a little little weird that it's not showing up but hey that's just how it goes sometimes right big a siege here eventually i want fuselating to stand your ground but we'll you know maybe we'll see if we get there okay I do wish this guy would die. Doesn't seem to be happening anytime soon, but oh well. At the four minute mark now too. Honestly, I think we just kind of ignore the bosses and just kill the mobs here. Hey, there's Fusely, that's good. There's a lot of them spawning in. I don't know. Maybe that's just me. Generator does very much nothing for us here, basically. Vitality, our health is already full, so also nothing. We can take Eye of the Storm. Eh, whatever. Right now and then a random AoE seems fine. Oop, okay, Terry down. 
Don't hate seeing that. And the game continues to give us, I don't want to say literally nothing here. Did just give us Fuse Slate recently, but I do want Mini Cliff and or Death Rounds to show up sometime soon, please, if you don't mind. Would appreciate. Okay, there's Stand Your Ground. That's a good one. Maybe better than Death Rounds, actually, now that I think about it. Okay, you're dead. I'll take Toma Power. I have faith that the next one's gonna give us a uh, a mini clip here, so we're gonna want this for sure. Absolutely, Toma Power will pay off. Trust. Look at that. See? I knew. go just kind of spin now pull everyone in faster with the black holes kill them with the shotgun and do a bunch of smiting simple as that uh these all suck your generator why not doesn't mean anything but whatever Collect a more experience here. Uh, armed and ready is fine. It gives us access to gun mastery. And it uh, does give us a reload rate increase. So that's nice too. Okay, there's gun mastery. Easy, weird how easy that one always is to find. Least important energy perk shows up immediately every time you get the chance. There's death rounds. Okay. Do you think those soul hearts that we immediately got after after death rounding, do you think they... Uh, oh, actually, no, I forgot. We lost HP for... Uh, hmm. We lost HP for... What's it called? I think I forget the name of. Shit, what's it called? Why would I forget the name of it now? Shit. Um, oh, hit me. There you go. Uh, Soma Power. Okay. I'll pick this up, get hit by that on purpose, uh, run and gun I guess, nothing matters here really. There's a spirit heart, don't mind if I do, intentional, intentional damage taken here to wipe out the field is kind of neat. Oh, I have I have full HP again. Someone hit me. Oh, I just it just went away from uh the the conversion. Okay. Uh, I guess in the wind here is fine. Yeah, hey, whatever. Hey, this is this is a pretty good run level wise here. I don't know if it's going to be new world record, but this is definitely a record for me for the smite build, I think. Um, I guess here at this point, I don't know. I guess you take dark arts. Maybe you pick up a wither here for a little bit of extra bonus damage. going here I guess we'll just take the one that doesn't do anything bad magic slice is not gonna hit anyone by the time this run ends so it's, it's just adding bloat perks even though I don't think we're leveling up anymore but whatever we'll just take this but again it doesn't really matter okay how do we do how do we do 24 24.7 that is hey I think a pretty good run. You can you can maybe say it sucks. I don't know, but it went pretty well. And if we had gotten, I feel like if we had gotten mini clip a bit earlier, it would have really gone off the chains. But like, what are you gonna do, right? We it took us a long time to find fan uh, fan fire. So 
Oh, well. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Uh, goodbye.